Okay, so I finished the cookies. They may not look nice. But, yeah. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go get my dad and see if he can try them. I'm gonna try one. Try this one. What's good, Barnett family? It's your boy Sam, and we're back with another video. And in today's video, we are baking with me, and we are baking ninja gingerbread cookies from Walmart. So let's see what we have. So we got the powder to make the dough. Um, we have the cutouts right here. We got the ninja kick. We have them fighting. We have Ninja Kick and the Flame. And then we have the Icing right here. So let's get started. So, first, before we start, I'm going to wash my hands. And then. I'm going to get a paper towel. So, now let's get ready. So, first thing we have to do is preheat the oven for three to 350 and wash the cutters with warm soapy water and dry them thoroughly. Lightly grease a baking sheet then. Okay, so I can get the water right here. And we're going to let these sit in the water. And let, while those sit in the water, we're going to get a baking sheet and grease it with the butter. So, I'm gonna go grab a baking sheet. So, now I'm gonna get the butter. Gonna... Alright, guys, so now that I have the butter, it wants me to lightly grease the baking sheet. So, I'm gonna go up and down and lightly grease it. Comment down below your favorite type of cookies that you like to make. Mine is chocolate chip cookies. Okay, so now that this is lightly greased, okay, I'm going to put this right here. So, okay, so now I'm going to dump this water out and thoroughly dry the cutters. Okay, so I'm going to, I'm going to, Rinse these out with the soap, and then I'm going to thoroughly dry them. Alright guys, I have rinsed them off with the soap. Now it's time to thoroughly dry them. And dry them off, make sure they're not super wet. Okay. They're dry. Gonna do this one. Okay. Comment down below some more baking ideas. Cause I think this one's gonna be fun. Alright, so now that I thoroughly dried them, it wants me to combine cookie mix with room temperature butter, butter, honey, and water. Mix into well blended two to three minutes dough takes some time to can come together allow the rest in the refrigerator for 30 minutes so now I'm going to get the mix and while I get the mix I'm going to get to room temperature now that we have this and the butter is room temperature I need to get this the mix and I need to combine the mix with room temperature water. So, yeah. 
My ball. Ball. This is the best ball. Bruh. The best ball to use. <laughs> it's the best ball to use. And I need to get room temperature water. Um. One tablespoon of room temperature water. One tablespoon of water would be pan or my butter water. So I'm gonna need to put more butter on the pan because kind of wasted water on it. But yeah. Put butter back right there. Okay. So I need to open it. this to it okay and now that that is in there put that over there so after I combine the cookie mix I need the room temperature water and I need one tablespoon well it's plus one tablespoon plus one teaspoon this is a tablespoon I think I hope this is right. I'm gonna add another one. I think I'm gonna need more water. Okay, that's enough. Now I need to add my butter. Just gonna take this butter, drop it in. I'm gonna do it again so you guys can see. Take my butter, drop it in there. <laughs> I need one fourth cup of milk. I mean, honey. One fourth cup of milk. One fourth cup of milk. That's one cup. I think this is one cup. Yeah, one fourth cup. One fourth cup of honey. Kind of peeled off. While I pour this honey, this pouring of honey is gonna take a while. What are your guys' favorite dessert? Mine is ice cream and cookies. Cause I like to make an ice cream sandwich with my cookies. I put the cook ice cream, scoop of ice cream on one of them, and um, I put the other ice the other cookie on top and I make a ice cream cookie. Before the before quarantine started, me and my sister Sanaya, we made ice cream Oreos. Okay. So I'm gonna rinse this. Okay, I've rinsed that. So now I've added the honey and water mix until well blended two to three minutes. So I gotta mix this. So I'm gonna mix this. But this is what it looks like. I got the handy dandy mixer. I'm gonna open this up. Okay, so, got the, I think, no, this is wrong, put this one here, 
and put this one in here. So now. I'm gonna blend. Well, this is gonna be loud, so I'm gonna blend this. I'm gonna blend this now. Just got the dough out of the refrigerator. It was in there for 30 minutes. So now that we took it out of there for 30 minutes, we on a lightly floured surface roll cookie dough to three to 15, three to 16 inches thick and desired thickness cut into shape with ninja cutter gathering and re-rolling as necessary place two inches apart on a prepared baking sheet okay and we're gonna move the light out the way and i'm gonna take the flour and dump it on here Okay, that's enough. Can you guys? Alright, so I got my flour right here. Um, I gotta pour this out. <laughs> Need to speak. Scoop it out. This looks like peanut butter. Alright. So, yeah, make sure I get all of it. Scoop it all out. Scoop it all out. Some more flour, though. Let's sprinkle it. Check out our Smacker Fact video that our parents did yet yesterday. They used a lot of flour. A lot of flour. Well, I got the roller and it wanted me to roll it to about. Just, roll just don't burn the, the kitchen. Dough up to three to sixteen inches. So just rolling this. Turn it the long way. No, no, turn this. Yeah. You gotta put a little more pressure. To it. I think I may need more flour. You gotta put a little more pressure on that, bro. <laughs> I need more flour. So, gonna get some more flour really fast. Okay, so now I think this is good. No, why is it coming up? evenly spread this on here. I think the flour is helping it stay down. Alright, so I evenly spread it this. Well now I'm gonna mix this again. I'm gonna mix this again. Just so it doesn't be why is it now I can spread this. This is gonna be a fail. I see. I don't know what the heck. 
this is doing. Okay, I'm getting the cookie cutters now. Where's the cookie cutters? Oh, I got one. We're going to do this one. Push it down. Push it down into it. And then pull it up. And then I think just pull it up and boom, made my first cookie. So I'm going to go put it on the pan roof and do the same thing again. So I'm going to do this the same way like I just did the other one. And once I'm, no, yeah, once I'm done cutting the cookies, I'm going to come back. I'm gonna cut one more. Cut this one. Actually, I'm gonna put salt on it. Not pepper. I'm gonna put salt. Okay. Salt. I'm gonna spread it out on here. Okay. And then I'm gonna go put this on the cookie sheet. Now that I've cut out the cookies. I have a little extra dough. I'm just going to make a custom cookie. I'm probably going to make probably going to make an S. No, I'm just going to use I'm just going to put them on the sheet. This is what they look like. So now I have to put them in the oven for nine to twelve, nine to eleven minutes, or until golden. So, don't forget this one right here has salt on it. Yeah, that one right there has salt on it. That's going to my dad. So I'm gonna put these in the oven right now. Then I'm gonna set a timer for 11 minutes. Okay. So now that the timer's set, I'm using sprinkles, blue sprinkles. I'm also using this icing, icing right here. And I pretty much don't need the box anymore. So, yeah. So. Once the cookies are done, I'm going to give you guys the final results. So the cookies are done. So now it's time to decorate them. I need to get some silvers. Okay, right? It actually makes the salt. off yeah. so they've cooled off. So now it's time to design them. So I'm going to design this one right here. This is the salt one. I'm going to draw a face on it. It's not sticking. I think. Oh. Over there. It's sticking now. Okay. One cookie down. Gotta get some sprinkles. Hold on. I'll put some sprinkles. So now, one smile, eyeball, one eyeball, and one sprinkle.
Rolling and smoothing it out, that's what you need to do. No, I put salt in it. I put salt in yours. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I do I taste salt. <laughs> okay, guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, smash the like button. I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. We're out. Peace. Kicking it with the barnet. Kicking it with the barnet. Yeah, we've been on Christmas. Kicking it with the barnet.